What's up, my Sin City crew? I'm back again with another video for you guys. Today, you guys, I have a special guest here, my little sister. Chastity, introduce yourself. Hey, my name is Chastity. Cindy's my big sister. Yep. The only sister I have, y'all. She's on my dad's side. We have the same father, different mothers. So, yes, this is my little sister. Hi. Anyway, you guys, today I'm preparing spaghetti, uh, barbecue baked beans. We're all going to barbecue uh, some ribs and uh, hamburgers and stuff like that. But so right now, I'm uh, I'm going to do some uh, spaghetti, barbecue baked beans. But I'm going to start preparing as far as cutting my onions and bell peppers up and stuff. And my sister's going to sit here and talk to me while I'm doing all that. So... Come along and join us, y'all. <laughs> you know how that go. That is right. So let me turn the camera this way so y'all can see me and see what I'm doing. I guess I can, unless you want to hold it, Chester. I'll hold it, yeah. I don't know how good I'm gonna be, but I'll hold it, girl. So see. what you're gonna have to do now is mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to I don't know because I don't know how to uh, make it where you can be looking at it from the back and it's still filming me. You see what I'm saying? Mm, I know what you're saying. Yeah, right okay. Now. So I don't know how that's going to work. Just hold it like that if you can. Okay. And then like. Just kind of come over here. Yeah. Like, like a camera, cameraman. Right. Yeah. But focus up, you know, where, where, when I'm talking, focus on my face. Mm -hmm. When I'm doing this, cutting it up, mm -hmm. and focus on the food, you know. Okay. Yeah. So. Let me get some plates out. I get some bowls where I can put my onion and bell peppers and stuff. I have to wash. I wish they had a got these bowls and stuff up out of here. What's going on, my Sin City crew? What's what's happening? I hadn't seen y'all in four whole days. Can y'all believe I hadn't seen y'all in four whole days? I know y'all can. Y'all can believe me. <laughs> Cause y'all been looking for me, right? Have y'all been looking for me? I know you have. Y'all haven't got that, uh, what you call that, uh, uh, when somebody come on and, uh, it tell you when they on. Notification. Yeah, notification. Exactly. Y'all haven't got the notification that I've been on. <laughs> That's because I haven't been on. But she's back. Yes, but I ain't back. I told y'all I ain't going nowhere, right? For sure. So, so y'all already know the business with that. I ain't going nowhere. <laughs> ain't nobody want me nowhere. I ain't going nowhere. I'm going to be here until the Lord take me away from here. So until then, I'm here. But yeah, I had wanted y'all to meet my little sister and everything because I had told y'all that she was going to be on it, but there's a lot of stuff been going on around here, so I hadn't been able to do a video. So, uh, I called her this morning when I texted her. I texted her, then I called. You know I, I texted and called her, right? Yeah, look, I was knocked out. I know, right? Oh, it was early. It was what, 8 something? Yeah. You know, I get up early now because I have to get dirty off of school and uh -huh. all that kind of stuff. So, um, I uh, got up early this morning. I'm gonna call Chess so she can come over here and go ahead and do a video with me. I'm so glad you did. Yeah, because you ain't doing nothing there. You might as well come <laughs> spend some time with your sister, sure. No. Because we don't spend time like we should. Life's so short. You understand this, what I'm saying? Now, this is true. And when life's so true. short, you have to really enjoy the time. With yeah, your exactly. Because you know, by our time. By exactly, time. by our time. Exactly. So. Every day I get on Facebook, somebody that lost their life, you know, mm -hmm. so I'll be like, man, you know, and mm -hmm. you, you, it, it's time to really get close to one another. It I, I usually be close to y'all, but I have came to the realization that it's time for me to get close to you and Jamie and my other two little brothers, you know, mm -hmm. I don't see them much neither. Yeah. Especially you know, since the pandemic been going on. Then, I really and then, you know, it. life just get in the way, you know, exactly. just, life get in the way. Life really gets in the way because I'm like that with a few people you know it's just right. 
don't want to be that way because it's still love, but exactly. you know, time just don't permit like exactly. that. Exactly. You know? Exactly. But That's you know, right now we gotta make time. We have because to make time. Because it's time, time to make time. It's time to make time. Because exactly. when you're sitting up in that, you know, funeral home, you're like, dang, man, I should have just, you know, took time out right. to see that person. Exactly. And so you don't want to have those regrets. And I don't want no regrets. It's, it's, it's really too late then. Exactly. You like know. My cousin, you know, you remember uh, Junior, my cousin just passed away. Mm -hmm. Now. Yeah. You know, we call each other on Facebook, yeah. and, or, or we call each other, and we talk on Facebook, inbox, and all that kind mm -hmm. of stuff. And it was like, you know, it was a lot of things that I wanted to talk to him about that I couldn't talk to him about. You know, I can't now. Yeah. yeah. So I'd be like, dang, I wish I had to just call him one more time. Yeah. You know. You know what I'm saying? So it's really too late. Yeah. But you know how that. Them regrets is not what we want. My bad peppers are on y'all. I'm doing spaghetti and uh, the baked, barbecue baked beans. So I'm doing like a lot of onions and I'm doing a lot of bell pepper. Yep, enough for both. Yeah, enough for both. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to saute both of them at the same time. Then I'm going to, you know, split it where it can go. Some in the spaghetti, some in the barbecue baked beans. Yep. And I'm glad to have my sister here with me. Oh, yeah, I can learn so something today. I'm so <laughs> glad to have her here with me today, y'all. Yes, you know, I'm gonna enjoy this. I know that's why they ain't gonna eat with me, right? For sure, you know. Exactly. They can't eat with me. I'm be ready. It ain't like you got nowhere to go, do you? You got somewhere to go? No, no. <laughs> Today my easy day. I ain't got nowhere to go, baby. Yeah. No appointments or no. Mm -mm. Huh? No. Yeah, that's good. And then see, you know, when the days you off and the days I'm off and stuff, we can, uh, you know, say hook Link up, up and, yeah. yeah, and do stuff together. Like I said. Have changed. The, I'm a private person, and I'm, I'm, I'm a you know to myself type person. But like I said, uh, life is so short. I really do need to start. Cause you remember you was just we was talking the other day over mm -hmm. the house. Mm -hmm. And all the things that's going on right now, chastity is important. It's very important. It's important to, for me to spend time with you and James. Yeah. When Jamie come in town, I need to see him. It's been on my heart. You know yeah. it's been on my heart, but in other times, I wouldn't even call. Would <laughs> what I know? No. I wouldn't even be calling like I've been calling. But you know, this is just your personality, heart. though. Yeah, that's you my know, personality. And I'm very misunderstood. You know that. I you know what? Like I said, my god sister, same exact birthday and everything, and I know her like a T. So, you know, it's not new. It's not and you got to understand people and just love them where they are and for who they are. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. A lot of people don't know how to do that. They feel like they want to tell people how they should act. Exactly. You can't tell nobody how to act. Exactly. You know, either you're going to just take them for who they are or, you know, exactly. don't even worry about it. Exactly, because one thing about people, you can't change who you people can't. are. Mm -mm. You, you can't. cannot change who you cannot change me. I've been like this, and I tell anybody, I've been like this 51 years. Yeah. You'll never change me. You know, let me show you. You'll never change me, and oh, because you talking, does not, it's not gonna change me. Mind. Just make yourself mad. <laughs> what kind of, I mean, how can you change me? And I've been like this all my life. My mama can't even change the way I am, you mm -hmm. know? So, I tell people, just accept me for who I am. I'm a good yeah. person. Yeah. You know that. Yeah. I'm 100. I'm going to keep it 100. People say that I'm fake. I have not one fake bone in my body. That's the problem with me. I'm too real. Kind of slam it to the side. Just, uh uh. Like, back this way. Okay. Like this. That's good. This way. Mm hmm. Like right this. Mm -hmm. But yeah. She knew with you, y'all. So forgive please, my baby sister. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. I'm going to be a better camera no, one more time. But what we should have did, no, it's not your fault. It's my fault because what I should have did, recorded it, kind of, Come no, up. go there. Yeah, like that. I should have uh, turned it the other way at first. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Y'all see y'all down in the background over there trying to steal some of her food? <laughs> a little tail. Y'all, y'all, get out of my kitchen while I'm cooking. She got a hot yeah, yeah. And don't come in here, but just call her. He can't even hear me. He got his <laughs> earplugs. Oh, she eating her little food out of uh -huh. her bowl. She take it. She get one of them. Oh, okay. And, and then, then walk, walk with it. Right. And then walk with it. You want her to smack it on it? Yeah, I did. I know uh -huh. what she had at first. Uh huh. Look, that's so funny. She take one, walk away, then walk all the way back. She a mess. She's smacking on. <laughs> I'm not finna fool with her. I know. Y'all, y'all, that's a real hot mess. You remember when you first came over here? 
She wanted all the attention. Yes, I love that dog. Mm -hmm. Oh. Like my daughter, her. I want all the smoke. I said, girl, if you don't sit there, I will see that bitch. <laughs> I, I want all, all the smoke. smoke. Oh, yeah. What smoke? Whatever it is, she right. wants it. <laughs> she always ready, honey. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah, miss her shit. My little pretty baby. But, you guys, I had to come to y'all and talk to y'all because I miss y'all. I miss y'all. I don't know if y'all miss me or not, but I miss y'all. And I might not get a chance to show the whole thing, but I'm going to do at least 20, 25 minutes today, you know, because I owe y'all this. I haven't seen y'all for that. I don't, like I said, I don't know if y'all miss me, but I sure miss y'all. I really do. Um, I've been getting my rest on, but I had something to happen, uh, you know, the weekend. I started Saturday morning and went over to what, yesterday? So I wasn't able to do videos and stuff, you know. I had a little personal issue going on. But I'm good now, y'all. So I'm back. And uh, like I said, the days that I'm off, I will be doing my videos. The day that I work, I will try. I'm not going to promise anything because I don't want people to say, well, you say you was going to. I'm going to try to do some videos when I'm off. You know, it just depends on how I feel or whatever the case may be. So anyway, uh, like I said, I ain't going nowhere. <laughs> I'm, I will be here. Y'all know I'm gonna be here. I'm gonna be here because I like to eat, I like to cook, I like to conversate with y'all. You know, I really do. I really like to conversate with my positive uh, uh, supporters. If you if you positive, I I want I want you in my life, you know. But the negative, I don't want all that. Cause I'm too positive, I'm too blessed. I'm too blessed to be stressed, baby. You can believe that one. Dirt ass, sit down. Y'all want to see me whoop dirt out? <laughs> I don't whoop him. I, you you don't have to whoop kids, you know. You don't, you shouldn't you shouldn't have to whoop the kids anyway. Mm -hmm. Uh just being uh you know talk to them, get an understanding. Look, this is the way it's going to be and we don't need no problems. You've been with me what he been with me going on uh I want to say about a month now. And uh everything been pretty good, you know. It's been pretty good. I can't I can't complain about him. He said grandma, he said he, I'm gonna he said I want to do it. Oh, yeah, this is what he said. Yeah, he said I want to do a YouTube <laughs> channel so and I can make me some money and I'll take care of you. Oh, you yeah. take care of me, I take care of you. That's See, kids about. recognize when somebody good to them and take care mm -hmm. of them, you know. Sure they remember that, y'all. Yeah. When you mistreat them, they remember, and when you good to them, they, they remember. Yep. So, either or they're gonna remember you, you know, whether it's good or bad. But I'd rather be on the good side, I know you know what I'm saying. Right. I'd rather be on the good side. But anyway, Chastity, you want to tell them a little about you? Ooh, girl. Uh, how you became my little sister? <laughs> <laughs> huh? Well. Ooh, what kind of story? Let's see. I don't know. Well, uh, your mom and dad are met. I know, right? I know, right? She met that brown little <laughs> man. Right. And then it was true from the on from there. Exactly. Then it came me and then my brother. Right. Exactly. Well, yeah. And we lost our dad. Uh, yeah. My dad was 38 when he passed away. So and I was, never, I was three. I never really knew him. Yep, yeah, you were three. And yeah. Jamie was just born. Yep, three so months. Was, yeah, three months. He was just born. So, you know, that was always very hard, not, yeah. you know, experiencing him as a person. Right. You know, we always think of that. Exactly. But, you know, I like to talk to different people. You know, and they tell me how he was and who he was, and you know, it just makes you proud of the man that you know you yeah, hear about. Cause our dad was a, a veteran and everything. He sure was. He served you know? in the uh, army and everything, so that made me proud of him. You know, he's a he's a, he was a good man. Uh, for as I know, you know, he treated me like a, a a good. He treated me good as my dad. Yeah. You know, Which him and my blessing. mom never got married, but. Uh, I was my daddy was always in my life. Yeah. So that was a good thing, you know. And then when he met your mom, uh -huh. he was always in your mom's life. And when y'all were born, he was yes, in your he you sure know, was. As long as he could. He, he, could he was there to the last day. Sure was. 
to his to his dying days. We was right there. You know, and it was just so hard and so sad that we had to go through that, but you know, the fact that he was there and he was present is, you know, that means it's a admirable. Lot. It's very that admirable. That means a lot, exactly. That means, that speaks for himself. It does. It you speaks know. volume type of man he was. Exactly. You know. And he was a great man. Yeah, I and, wish I knew him. And that's crazy because he looks so much like that man. I oh know, right? It's just so strong. It's so strong, man. <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah, it. You look just like Larry. You look right. just like Larry. All three of us. Yep. And my brother, oh my God. He's just Skin like image. He's just like my dad. Lil Paul Brown. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Lil Paul Brown. So yep. Mm. I'm proud of him. I wish he was still here with us. He was a trip with his step back. I sure wish I had experience. Laughing and joking and acting a <laughs> fool. That was him. So I end up he ended up seeing okay, so he ended up seeing both of my boys. Mm-hmm. I don't think he's seen none of my girls, but he's seen both of my boys, and man, he just thought he was real, a real granddaddy, y'all. <laughs> he was a real granddaddy, but he ain't know how to be no granddaddy. He come over there to try to pick the boys up and <laughs> kick them with them and stuff, but he did a good job as far as being a father and a mm -hmm. grandfather. I can say that, yeah. you know, and I'm proud of him. You know, I know he'll be proud of us if he was living. Yeah, I you think know. so too. He gonna be around. He coming. He coming. To, <laughs> he coming to our rescue. You can believe that. <laughs> and he ain't take no stuff. Sure. I think that's why I got my personality. Yes, from. I think both of us got some of that. Yeah, because I don't take no mess. Uh uh. I'm sweet as gold though. Yeah. I think you you more. Um, <clears throat> me and you so different, but. You don't take no mess. Yeah. I don't take no mess neither. I think you speak your mind more than I do. I do. And yeah. I, I really do. I really don't be caring. <laughs> yeah, that's what I want to say. You speak your mind more than that. I, I kind of bite my tongue yeah. a little bit. Yeah. yeah, Because of, you know, because I know I have, I can say ugly things. Mm -hmm. And I know that it's things that will come out of my mouth that I will regret later. Yeah. So I try mm -hmm. not to speak ugly things because I don't, I don't, you know. It's just something that I ain't ever did. Mm -hmm. And if I, like I always say, if I ever said anything to anybody, I'm the type of person I think about what yeah. I said later. You know, I'm like, I shouldn't have said yeah. that. Well, let me call and apologize. You know what I'm saying? Now, if I'm right and you didn't, you know, got on my last nerve, you deserve it. No, <laughs> you deserve it. I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't got no apology for you. But if I didn't say something uh -huh. out of, you know, out of anger, just out of out anger, straight out of exactly, anger. You know, yep. I know mm -hmm. it, it, it's kind of, you know. Yeah, okay, yeah. Exactly. It come, takes come a big person. Them. It takes a big person to know when to go back and apologize. Exactly. And, and that's me. I, I just have a conscience, y'all. Yeah. I have always, but my little sister right there. I got a conscience with the bad. people I like or exactly. that I care about. Exactly. You got to care about. But if you, you ain't know? about none, then you know you get none. Exactly. And if you didn't, you didn't deserve to be, you know, talked to any kind of way. But I still kind of, you know, like I'm, I should kind of got to watch it. Yeah. yeah. You know. I don't like to be ugly towards people. That's just me. Yeah. You know? I'd be like, yeah, you know, next time I don't even come my way. Mm. Mm. What's that? Mm. Hey, that's how I don't work. Don't come my mm. way, baby. You mm. MP, huh? Mm. Yeah, but anyway. Yeah, my little sister, she's baby. It's that Libra in her, baby. I'm a cast and she a Libra. Yeah. We, as, we are very outspoken. Libras are very outspoken. Yeah, because my baby girl a Libra. Yeah. You know, we want you to know how we feel. Don't play. They we don't want play. you to know how, how we feel. Play. Have a little boyfriend out there knocking at the door. He walks out here. I said, don't do that, little freak. Don't do that. <laughs> Cause she don't care. Mama, why are you why are you talking to him and I'm mad at him? I said, because I know how to treat people. Mm -hmm. You got to know how to treat people. Because, again, as I would say, life is so short. Yeah. He go out there get in his car and leave. You've been having him beating on the door for 15, 20 minutes. You ain't going to the door. Or you tell me, well, tell him I ain't here or whatever the case may be. Yeah. Then something happens to him. You're going to hate that. Yeah. So love people while you can. Hug people while you can. Love them. Show them. Tell them. Yeah. You know what you I'm saying? Yeah. That just speaks louder than words. You ain't. Don't tell me. Show me. I know that's right. You know what I'm saying? Know, show right. me how much you love me. Because tomorrow, not even today, is promised to mm -hmm. us, y'all. The you next moment. Saying? And that's just the way I feel. I have always been like that. I tell anybody, <clears throat> I am so blessed. I have always been blessed all my life. Because I have never been in a situation where I have lost uh, a, a place to stay. If I lost it, I lost it on my own. I moved out. Never had the lights cut off on us. 
always had food in my refrigerator. I always was able to pay my bills. I always was able to feed my children. So to me, that is a blessing. Mm -hmm. And for that reason, that's why I'm humble to the man up above. I don't get no human, no, no praise. I praise Jehovah God and Jesus Christ only. And that's just me. And you would never change the way I feel about my God, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Right. So, yeah, people right. can say what they want to say about me. I'm evil, I'm this, I'm fake, I'm that. Baby, I ain't a fake bone in my body. I'm real. That's my problem. I'm too real. And people can't, if a person can't accept a real person, then you ain't real. So, that's how I feel about it. I mean, so you anyway, have to try. That's right. Hmm. But yeah, so I'm going to do these, I'm going to saute these onions <clears throat> and bell peppers. Y'all. And I make them kind of big, y'all, because you know when you saute them and cook them, mm -hmm. they're going to cook down anyway. Right, they're going to cook down anyway. Mm -hmm. And be just right. Y'all know I can talk. <laughs> I be running my mouth chest. You ever, do you watch me? You yeah, watch you watch of course me? I do. You do? Girl, you so talk you know, like me. We both like to talk. Man. You know, we I, can I, talk I, to anybody about anything. I, I, exactly. And you I'm know? a people's person, because I'm the type of person, Cassidy, that... I can meet you. Uh -huh. And I'm talking about, I have been at the nail shop before. And men and women have got it, yeah, nail shop before all the, you know, mm -hmm. yeah. and men and women have sat there beside each other. We talk. Yeah. And they be telling me what they going through as far as, you know, uh, their relationships or something like mm -hmm. that. And, and, and so they be overweight a little bit. They could be overweight to sit in any situation. And I'm like, and, and this before I became even 50, you know, yeah. I was in my late 40, 45, 46. And they were like, how old are you? I was like, 45, 46 or whatever. You look good to be your age, this, that, and other. And I, mean, I said, look, and they'll tell me what they going through with their husband and stuff like that. How they down talk them and mm -hmm. down rate them and stuff. And you know what I tell them? I lift their spirits up. Baby, you look good. I know this, right? Looks are not... Important. Exactly. It's not everything. Mm -mm. It's the way you carry yourself. You're a beautiful lady. I don't care how big you think you are. And myself as well. Yeah, I want to lose weight and get myself for health reasons. Not exactly. because I can't get no man or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm not looking for nothing like that. It's for health reasons the purpose of me losing weight. Mm -hmm. But I would tell them, I said, let me tell you something. Never let a man make you feel bad. That's true. number one. Never let a man make you feel bad and I'm just trying to try, okay, so back then I was taking them fentramines. And I was like, you know what I'm saying? I take fentramines to keep my weight down. I don't take them anymore. I hadn't took them in three years. And she'd be like, I give them all the information. If this mm -hmm. will make you feel better, you want you want to try this? Okay, yeah, try this. Yeah. We'll, you, we'll exchange numbers. We'll call each other. And I'd be like, do you want to go work out? Try to lift people's spirits up, then bring them down. I know that's right. You supposed to. You supposed to. Mm -mm. Men already out here make some women feel bad. Us as women, exactly. To that's not our job to do that to exactly. other women. I never understood that. I never understood woman that. Down. Exactly. You supposed to build a, another woman up to make them feel good. That's the type of person I am. You Me too. Me and too. I don't care. I don't care nothing. It takes about. a special person to do that because it's so easy to just be. Rude and just exactly. nasty, exactly. but honey, to and show your heart, said, it, it's it's something serious. And that's why I said I'm a people's person because mm -hmm. I can I can have a conversation and win your heart just like that. Yeah, because yeah. that's how. But that's I a am. genuine person. That's a genuine. That's person. a genuine person. I've always been like this, because you, you know leave with love. You know, you, you have. Love. Yeah, I'm you always have love. been easy to talk to and everything. You know, I might kind of stay my distance from people. That's just my. That's you know, your person. You always been that way. I, I, I'm a, I stay my my distance because I felt like I had my kids to take care of. I didn't have time to rip and run the street. Mm -hmm. Come on, your house visiting you and all that kind of stuff. I had a family. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And I raised my children. Now that I don't have any kids, yeah, I can do what I want to do now mm -hmm. and have a lot of fun. But now since I got dirty. Cause I ain't let him go nowhere. God and fell in love with my grandbaby. Yeah. I don't want him to go nowhere. He's my lifeline. I think about him. I get up every morning and get him up. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. For him to do that virtual schooling and stuff like that. But because this this is what I'm at the age now where I can sit down and I can deal with him as well. Mm -hmm. If I want to go somewhere, my daughter in there can watch him. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? While I'm at work, she watch him. While she didn't work, I got it. Yep. So it's teamwork around her. Mm -hmm. And work out just perfect. But anyway, you guys, 
I, like I said, I'm not going to get a chance to cook everything, but Walt is going to come and he's going to do a video and we're going to barbecue. We're going to put everything together and I guess I'll probably eat and that way you'll see my spaghetti, my barbecue, baked beans, the ribs and everything else. But as for right now, I'm going to let you go and I'm going to try to finish doing this cooking and I'm glad that you got a chance to meet my sister and I'll see you in the next video. Like, share, subscribe, hit that bell and don't forget about me. <laughs> See you later.